person. Everyone that gets in the car, just about, I'd say 90%, always their reaction is, there's more headroom in this than my car. And I have a truck, or I have a big sedan, or I have an SUV. They're always amazed at it, and I always tell them that's why we're here. We're here because you have to get in it to believe it. You have to drive it to believe it. This is what we uh, is known as a phase two electric vehicle. Uh, obviously, we started out with a phase one. Many of those were tested in Europe. This is a phase two, which has heightened functionality, which we're bringing out in 010. We are going to be bringing out a phase three in the 2012 calendar year. The nice thing about the smart car electric drive is you don't compromise any of your cargo space or your passenger room. They're able to use the exact same chassis structure of the car and not have to reconfigure it to make space for batteries or the electric motor. Offering the vehicle in a four-year lease, uh, you know, obviously uh, you would utilize it over that period of time and you, you would return it at the end of that period. They're going to um, look the same except for certain color cues that they've done to accentuate that it's an electric drive. Like our Tridian safety cell, which is the roll cage, is green on the electric drive. The wheels have a green alloy to them. Those kind of accents. But other than that, it's identical to a regular Spark 4.2. As you can well imagine, these are just coming to market. There's a lot of questions. And it's very fair that the fact that there'd be a lot of questions, you know, how do I charge it? What's my range? You know, what is the cost of the infrastructure? It's all, they're all very, very uh, fair questions. And the Electric Drive Smart will uh, go highway speeds, so it'll get you to work if you're going on the turnpike or an expressway. When you get to work, let's say you've expended more than 50% of your battery power, you can plug it into a regular 110 outlet to get it recharged so by the end of your workday, you've got possibly 100% charge again, but enough to then get you back home. We're working very closely with, with Coulomb as well as other providers of charging stations. Now that technology is actually happening very quickly. The city of Manhattan, the city of New York, just announced that they're going to go ahead and put up, I'll say several hundred, for, for lack of my memory here, I'll say several hundred charging stations over a short period of time. With the, in the effort to build the electric car infrastructure. So it's all gonna happen relatively quickly over the next 36 months.